the last video we look at uh, attaching, um, creating a very simple bond structure and uh, attaching um, some simple basic objects. So there's one more thing I want to tell you about uh, uh, the symmetry of bonds. So let's just create a new, this is a very, very short video, right? So let's just create um, a new file here and I delete the cube. I go to my autographic view and I add armature. I added my bone there and I'm going to go shift D and I'm going to add a bone here. Okay, so as you can see, now, if we go and to look, to look at the, let's just remove that one. Oh, sorry. I didn't want to uh, duplicate inside as a different object. So I'm going to edit mode and then I'm going to shift D, right? Okay, so I have my armature here. I didn't want a new armature, that's what I mean. So I have bone, bone one, zero, zero, one. Okay, so um, there is something, uh, if you want to go and uh, change things in your bone, here you go. If you have the little icon here, the bow, right? So uh, there is something that you can do uh, without using the mirroring, let's say, uh, modify or anything. You, there's something in Blender that you use name conventions. So this one, this is the bone, and this is bone 001. We're going to change the name to left, to L capital L. That would be the left. Although it looks like on the right side of the screen, it's actually the left. If you're looking at, if you're doing a character, then if the character is facing you, that would be the left. Okay, so we just put it there, bone dot L, capital L. So now there is something that you can do. You select this bone and go to pose mode. Oh no, is that pose? No, actually it's edit mode, sorry. Uh, and go to armature, symmetrize, symmetrize. Okay, so now uh, it's symmetric and then it automatically creates uh, the name bone.r. Okay. So uh, let's create another one. Let me just come here and shift D, that one now. Uh, there's no parenting going on at the moment. So here it creates L001. Uh, if I try now to symmetrize, um, it did because it had the L. As long as you have L and R, yeah, that name convention, you will do it. If you have, let's see, another one. And I just changed the name, I removed the L here. Let's have a look. And then if I try to do it, it's not going to work. So you be aware of this. You need the name convention. Nothing happens. Yeah, I'm trying to symmetrize it and nothing happens. Okay, so I don't need this one. So now I can, I can come here and P connected. Control P. I think I didn't do it correctly. This one, Control P, keep offset. Oh yeah, now it worked. Keep offset, Control P. So now, as you can see, uh, these two bones are child and uh, children of the main bone. Okay, I go here to pose mode and I rotate. Yeah. You will rotate. Okay, and I can do the same thing with this one. Uh, I need to go to edit mode. Shift P. I can do connected. Yeah, it depends what you're doing really. Shift T, Shift P, and that one like that. Shift P. Um, keep offset. So now I have, I can test this, I can move this one, everyone's going to move. I can move that one, and then I can move this independently. Yeah, and then you can animate all those things, 
right? Okay, that's all for this video now. I just want you to be aware of this name convention that you can use, uh, use symmetry. And I think there was something else I want to tell, but I can't remember. So if when I remember, I do another video. Okay, I'll see you in the next video.